Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are doing another wig tutorial. I've been wearing wigs like this lately because they're not this wig. We are not reviewing this wig. I'm going to show you the wig that we are going to be reviewing, but I've been wearing this natural texture here. It looks very natural. I have a wig like this before, but it's a shorter and different um, a different brand this is the wig that we are going to be trying out this is sensational textured lace wig and this is heartbreaker and is 1b i've been seeing them lately beauty supply store and i really did like it i was like oh my god this looks so natural so i went ahead and get another one well this one is from sensational the other one i got i don't even remember the brand this is all curl types from 3b to 4c and this one is heartbreaker, like I said. So let me show you guys what she looks like. And I really do like this type of hair textures because they look very, very natural. And I want to show you guys exactly how it looks on my head. So let me just show you guys what the hair looks like. Let me just take it out from this. So this is the hair. It's a little bit longer than the one that I have so beautiful and it looks so natural so you get three combs in the, the wigs you get two on the side and one in the bottom here now this is what it she looks like so i'm gonna take out it looks so beautiful okay and my hair texture is 4c so that's why i like wearing those type of wigs okay so let me show you guys the hair i'm gonna try this on i hope this fits really good because some wigs just not for my head because I got big head so we're gonna try this on and see now this fits really good really tight and you guys can see how it looks in the front look kind of oldie <laughs> look kind of oldie I'm not really liking this texture in the front. It just look very coarse, but this is what it looks like. You guys could see the curl pattern. I'm going to open up the curls a little bit. This is just look like house on the prairie type curls. <laughs> my hair is like a 4C, so this matches my hair a lot. If I want to keep a little bit out, I can. And I usually do that because like if my lace is showing, I could just take off some of my hair. Now my hair is braided back, but I'm just going to bring back the stocking cap a little bit. I have some of my hair out so it could look a little bit more natural in the front. So I just want to show you guys what I usually do because I have a wig like this. I usually just you know just have some of my hair out because I have a lot of edges and my hair is natural so it will blend in so well I'm not gonna mess with the curls yet I want to see if I could smooth this out in the front because as you guys can see the difference I just want to show you guys this is a part that is not uh, pressed down. It just looks a little bit more natural when you press it down. I'll just pass it in a little bit so you could flatten it a little bit. It looks much better like that. Now you see the difference? I don't know last time I used a hot comb. <laughs> I usually don't like hot combs. You see, if you play with the curls a little bit, it's just going to come out. So just what I'm going to do, so it look a little bit more natural. This looks so good. And this is a Little House on the Perry Curls. And this is 2020, okay? <laughs> you really don't have to do too much to it. So like when you're playing with the hair, you do get a little little hair out I don't want to take out much of the curls I just want to open it out a little bit so it look a little bit fuller like if you guys want to look a little natural you can I'm gonna go back again with my comb just so you know fix it
So this is just like a fast wig if you guys want something natural or if you want something different. I really do like sensational wigs. I think their wigs are really, really good when it comes to these type of wigs. Like if you guys don't know about these type of wigs, they have them in the beauty supply store. They have different brands. You guys see from the side how it is. I really do like it. It just looks so good. If you guys want to try this wig out, I would have it, all the information in the description box for you guys. This wig, I believe, is around $23. I got this here from Elevate Styles. I will try to find um, other links and put also put it in the description box for you guys. I would suggest purchase your wig online. It's a little bit more cheaper than when you go to the beauty supply. So I don't know why they always like the wigs are very very expensive at the beauty supply store the curls drop down a little bit you could use this curling stuff that I got this from Amazon you could use these to curl the hair back and this is what I've been using on my natural wigs because sometimes yes the curl drop down wind the curls back but girl I just love this let me show you guys the back of this I don't think I took the curls off in the back well, let me know in the comments below what you guys think about this wig. I love it. I'm going to try to get more hair like this because I am so happy that Sensational and other brands are coming out with texture hair like this. I do like it. It looks so natural. Girl, you can't tell me that's not my hair, girl. It is my hair, girl. I paid $23. <laughs> Thank you so much. See you guys in my next video. Bye.